Hi everybody, in this video I'm going to show you how to identify Google fonts in your Webflow project and replace them with local font files. So without further ado, let's start. So first of all, you go to your website and you right click anywhere and choose inspect to open the website inspector, switch to the tab sources. And if you see fontsgoogleapis.com or fontsgstatic.com, your website is using Google Fonts. Open uh, the folder and uh, double click on uh, this CSS file. And you can see your website is using Lato and it is also using Sora. So now we know what fonts are using from, uh, what fonts are used from Google Fonts. Go back to your website's settings, switch over to the um, tab fonts. You can see um, here's a Google font installed, delete it. Hit over to Google fonts, search for your font, Sora. Click here, download the entire font family. Get, go back to your website settings, click on upload fonts. Navigate to the um, folder with the static font files and choose the right font file. Upload it. Click on upload font file again. And if you switch to the designer, you can see that the first font is replaced correctly. It's still Sora. Um, if you want, you can publish it again. And after you've published, you can refresh your live site. Check this file again and search for Sora. You can see no matches, so Sora is already um, replaced. Now we still have Lato. In case you don't know where Lato was used, because uh, you don't find it in the project uh, settings here uh, listed under installed Google fonts. Um, you probably used that font somewhere um, not on purpose. So what you need to do then is uh, open this folder, assets website files, open the CSS and now search here for Lato. Now you can see I have one match, a class called hum is using the font Lato. Go back to the designer, click on this icon for the style manager, search for hum, hover over it. Ah, you can see this is using the font file Lato. And if you click here, you can see the pages uh, where the file, uh, where this um, um, class is used. Click on it, it will bring you to the page. And if you click or hover again, it will highlight the element that uses the class hum. Click on it, switch to the styles and replace it or click here and reset it. And now it's using the base font. If you want to use Lato anyway, go back again to Google fonts, download it like I showed you before and upload it in your page settings in the fonts tab um, as an additional font. And yeah, after you have replaced everything, republish your website again, go to the live site, refresh it. And now you can see that uh, Google fonts um, file folders are not shown anymore. That's the way how you delete uh, and replace Google fonts from your website and use um, uh, local files instead. And don't forget to subscribe for more. Thanks. Thank you.